is shaking. All of my homies in the universe. So, uh, survived the hurricane. Ended up being a dud. Test, 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 test. Audio appears to be working correctly. Um, yeah, got a lot of wind, some rain. Uh, yards kind of flooded, lost electricity for a little while, but nothing bad. Not bad at all. Um, all my old skirting was just sitting in the yard, which wasn't ideal because the high winds could have picked up some of them and launched them towards someone's vehicle, which would have been terrible. Uh, what is today? It's Tuesday. Don't know what the date is. Doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, so made a little run to the landfill. Drop off my old skirting. So that's done. Uh, was a little bit muddy and gross and hectic. Wasn't a lot of people there, but I don't know how many of y'all have actually gone to a landfill. It is a disgusting experience. Still haven't shaved, beard's coming in nicely. Gonna be a while before I get my Viking look back though. Yep, I still have shaver's remorse, whatever. Uh, I slept great last night, which made up for the night previous, where I slept like absolute dog shit. Power went out at three in the morning. I was fucking hot. Slept like 10 hours last night, so made up for it. Stand by, I think my lens is getting frothy. Yeah, I'm having that same problem that I get every summer where my lens, the glass on my lens is considerably colder than the air outside. So when I come outside, the lens just like gets consumed with condensation or frostiness. It's quite annoying, but the solution to that would be to come outside a little sooner, like a little forethought on my part. Okay, I want to make a video. Let me put, get my camera outside so it can acclimate to the heat and humidity. But I didn't, I didn't do that this time. So now I'm just going to sit here and be annoyed over and over again as I wait for it to thaw. Mm. So not as many wasps. Uh, replacing the skirting they were able to knock down two or three wasp nests while they were doing it one of the guys got stung I feel badly about that I told him I said y'all need to have some hornet spray I'm not playing Those fuckers are everywhere so hopefully they'll be away for a while I don't know it's hard to say but I really really hate them so much I just I don't know. I, I, I don't know the role of a wasp in the ecosystem. I'm sure it plays a part. I've read about them that they pollinate. You know what? I don't give a fuck. I really don't. I don't care what they do. I hate them. I wish they would all die. Enough about that. Okay, so it's Tuesday. Hurricane is come and gone, kind of popped up out of nowhere, really threw me off a little bit. Lost power the night before it actually hit for like 12 hours. That was absolutely fucking horrible. I was getting hot. I didn't sleep well. All my electronics were down. I think I already discussed all this. And I replaced the fan on my computer. Yeah, that whole thing. I got another fan that's supposed to be 10 times better than the one I got, but I kind of don't want to fuck with it because it's the one I got in there is working just fine. So for some reason, my CPU or my motherboard get too hot, I can monitor that through a couple of programs, then I'll change out for this better fan, but if it doesn't run too hot, then what's the fucking point? Uh, so yeah, still got some projects. Uh, gotta replace the porch, or at least the steps on the porch <laughs> before somebody trips and kills themselves. Uh, neighbor's dogs won't shut the fuck up. Low yippy. All fucking day, man. They just won't zip it. Shit was my dome yesterday, so it looks pretty good. Uh, what's up? Word. Um, I still gotta make... I don't know what I'm gonna do. Okay, so all the, the skirting, the old skirting, fit in the back of my truck just fine. Hauled it off. But now I have... 
<coughs> the trim <coughs> portions, which are, some of them are 12 feet long. Well, my bed's only six feet. You can't drive around with big pieces of vinyl sticking six feet out the back of your fucking truck. You just can't do it. So I'm gonna have to get some 10 snips or something and chop all those pieces into smaller pieces. I kind of wish they would have done that in the first fucking place. It would have helped me a lot, but they didn't. So I'm stuck with these gigantic, unbelievably dangerous, long fucking pieces of vinyl from my skirting that Unless I, even if I go at night, if a cop sees me, I'm gonna get fucked. I'm gonna get pulled over, man, because you can't have big old long pieces hanging out the back of your vehicle. You have to put a red rag or tile on the towel, tile, towel on the end of the part that's hanging out of the back of your vehicle. You can do it. It's just, it's dangerous and um, it's just not a great idea for a lot of reasons. Uh, yeah, man, I hope everybody's doing well. I really do. Some of y'all may know. I just, I'm just a little pissy in the summer. I just hate the heat and the humidity. I hate it. I hate it so much. Oh, God, I wish I lived in Norway. I really do. I fucking hate it. Um... And, and Biscuit Cabin Fever, he just hates being inside for more than a few hours at a time. <clears throat> and I get it. He's independent. He's curious. He likes to be out with nature. Did y'all see that fucking thing? A wasp. It was a wasp. Doing a flyby, trying to intimidate me. I will not be intimidated off of my own porch. Or was that a horse fly? nasty fucking things start showing up too when there's sitting water which I have a lot of which is a breeding ground for dragonflies which I embrace I wish the dragonflies would fucking overpopulate the area and eat all of the wasps that would be ideal I've had a conversation with these fucking things repeatedly and I have made a deal with them that I will not fuck with them or their livelihood or their families. In return, I need them to attack and eat all the wasps. That's all I'm asking for. It's really not that big of a deal. I thought we had an understanding. I don't know if they're just not good hunters or they're not old enough to hunt yet. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with these dragonflies, but they are not doing their end of the bargain that I've made with them. So. There's that. Uh, I got a couple of new props here. I got a Waffle House cup and a cup from Cafe Du Monde. That Cafe Du Monde coffee cup, I took from the Cafe Du Monde on Decatur Street in the French Quarter in 1990. Did you hear what I said? 1990. I have had that coffee cup. The Waffle House I got a few years ago in the Waffle House I used to go to, not the one that I go to now, but a different one. <clears throat> and I said, hey, can I, uh, I don't have coffee cup. Can I buy one of the coffee cups? She goes, oh yeah, we have the souvenir cup. I was like, this, this, this. I don't want the souvenir cup. I want one of the real, the authentic, the cup that you give. You know, we don't sell those. I said, what do you mean you don't sell them? I know you don't sell them a lot, and you're not supposed to, and you're supposed to sell me the souvenir cup, but I'm, psh, I'll slip you a 10 and I'll just walk out of here with this cup and no one needs to know. She's like, are you serious? I said, yes, I'm serious. Do I look like I'm kidding? I'm just gonna casually walk out with the cup that I'm currently drinking out of. In return, you'll get a $10 bill on top of your normal $4 tip. It's a win-win. What's the problem? She's like, all right, if you want the cup that bad, I don't give a fuck. So. Hey, speaking of wasps, there's one right there. Yep, hold on. See, they're flying around because they're confused. They can't get to their previously established homes because the new skirting, A, knocked the nest down. B, there's no easy access to them. So, get fucked, you little angry, hostile. Mmm, waste of waste of everything. Whatever it is that makes up a wasp, it's an absolute waste. 
I guess they have a DNA structure. I don't know. I don't care. I hate them. So anyhow, got the cup from Waffle House. Kind of turned into a whole thing there, but I was like, I don't know how much more clear I can make this. Like the Café du Monde cup I have. That is not one of the souvenir cups you get in the shop. That's an actual cup from the table where you're eating your beignets and coffee. That's just kind of my thing. I used to have a cup from Silver Skillet. That was a truck stop in Sacramento I used to eat at a lot. But um, when I transitioned from Sacramento to San Francisco, it got lost. So the next time I go back to Sacramento, I'm going to have to go to Silver Skillet and get me another coffee cup. I have a very strange collection of coffee cups. It's a little obsession of mine that I may or may not have spoken about in previous videos. So I'm doing fine. I hope y'all are well. If you're not, hopefully watching this video is brought mm, like such a tiny percent, like barely measurable percentage points in the upward direction. That is my hope. I hope that it's made you smile and feel better about life and inhale my good, exhale the bad. That's all you have to do. It's that easy. Hey, fly. That's, a, that's one of them little weird wood-eaten bees. You see those little weird things, man? They're bees, but they move kind of faster and they eat through wood. They're really annoying. I don't like them. I don't like the way they look. I don't like the way they move around. I don't trust them. I don't trust those little motherfuckers. I don't know that they sting people. I don't I don't know that they sting or attack, but something about them ain't right. They move too fast. Yeah, I don't trust them. But anyhow, I think I've been talking long enough. I hope everybody has a great what's left of your Tuesday. Um, please feel free to reach out to me in the form of a comment or hit the like or the dislike button, whatever it is that you feel like you need to do. Uh, if you don't want your comment to be seen by the whole universe, feel free to hit me up privately via Google Hangout or Gmail, or if you found me on Facebook, whatever. Send me a chat, I'll do my best to respond. So. To sum it up, survived the hurricane, my skirting's been replaced, old skirting's been removed from the yard so I no lo longer look like Sanford and Son, and um, Little Biscuit is doing just fine. He's inside at the moment, eating his new food that he loves, by the way. Have I mentioned that if my audio isn't on, I'm gonna fucking murder somebody? Okay, it should be. The little meter's going, so I can only assume that it's working correctly. But yeah, until my next video, don't know when that will be. Hope y'all have a great Tuesday. And um, soak in some of my good. Exhale the bad. And uh, y'all know what's up. Till my next video, everybody stay cool. Where's my remote? I'm out. <laughs>